audio article entitled A Funny Thing Happened at the Pipeline Protest by the Common Constitutionalist. If you are a regular reader, you will recognize the Dakota Access Pipeline, which when completed will transport oil from the Bakken oil fields near Stanley, North Dakota to Pocota, Illinois. The contractor, Precision Pipeline, says the pipeline will be capable of transporting between 450,000 and 570,000 barrels per day of domestic crude. Although not as hub highly publicized as the now defunct Keystone XL Pipeline project, the Dakota is still a major undertaking spanning four states and costing $3.8 billion. If you wish to read about the Dakota Access Pipeline, I wrote about it in July. It's entitled, The Pipeline We Know Little About. Just go to my site, type in the pipeline we know little about in the search bar, and hit enter, and it'll come up. As one would expect with projects such as this, there are bound to be protests. After all, it is big oil, and who better to protest an easy target like that? The Des Moines Register reported that last Wednesday, 30 protesters were arrested as they chanted, This is what democracy looks like. I don't know whether any of the arresting officers had to remind the chanters that we don't live in a democracy, but I suppose I'm just nitpicking. I guess this is what a re representative republic looks like wouldn't really work. Now, unlike Black Matters, a Black Lives Matter protests, the group was peaceful and did not resist arrest. Of course, most were aging hippies and ignorant soccer moms. Crystal DeFott, 31 of Bettendorf, a stay-at-home mom of three children, was among those arrested as she stood with other protesters in solidarity against the pipeline. Every year you hear about oil spills. I don't want oil in the water that my children drink. This is a moral responsibility for me, DeFott said. But there was another protester arrested who actually had a sense of humor which is unusual for leftist protesters. The man posted on Reddit, I was arrested at protest Wednesday. The trooper asked me what I had in my pockets. He didn't believe me. While the man was being arrested, he pulled out a Monopoly chance card that read, Get out of jail free, which he handed to the arresting officer. Some of the commenters on his Reddit account didn't believe him, so he posted a photo of the police evidence bag on which was written, Stop Pipeline Pin, E-Cigarette, Car Key, and Monopoly Get Out of Jail card. Unfortunately for the protester, Monopoly cards, just as Monopoly money, don't really work in the real world. However, he did prompt a laugh from the cop, and then, uh, then the protester said, then he tightened the zip cuffs on me. The protester then posted that he did, in fact, go directly to jail. He did not pass go, nor did he collect $200. Nowhere was it reported that the police instead gave him an opportunity to roll doubles. He was freed on $300 bond. Thanks for listening.